I went to the Renaissance Folk Guild and that is in Conover. I visited there last night and I met an awesome little boy along with the little girl and they are the newest additions to creating joey pouches to send to Australia. Now the story behind this is that teachers who actually work throughout the day, they come here at nighttime and they run this awesome program teaching kids not only how to sew but also to cook as well. The more you read, the more you realize that these rescue groups need help. Alex and Isla are learning how to make joey pouches for the wildlife in Australia. It takes 30 pouches for each animal. Alex says he is saving one life at a time. There's a wildfire in Australia and half of their mothers might have gotten hurt or killed. I want to save the joeys, so they need homes. I talked to Joanne and thought this was something that we could do here at the Guild and if people could come in and donate the fabric because you know we're a school we're not a market we don't have have the fabric if they come in and donate the fabric we will teach them how to make their own joey bags and we will uh, we'll be taking donations for shipping and we will be in charge of shipping all of them his teachers joanne chase and melissa bradshaw say they just want each child to know how to make a difference and are glad they are able to help well we're teachers so. Yeah, <laughs> and our hearts are in. We want to see young people doing, going out, and making the world a better place. And you know, we tease Alex and say, "Alex, you are saving the world one Joey pouch at a time." And then, when Isla came in, we were like, "Yay, one more!" The parents say they're just proud of their children for taking the initiative to make a difference. Isla just started researching these fires on her own and started learning how they started and how they were affecting the animals. And then we got really excited when we saw the um, open sewing times and doing the joey pouches. So she w really wanted to do that. And we're following the vets that are over there helping and donating. So this has been a great learning experience for her and just touches my heart to see how kind she is and how she wants to help out. I could not be more proud of Alex. I was very excited and just makes my heart happy to see how much he wants to help the animals in Australia and everything around the world. He's just wanting to make a better place. So that is an awesome program. If you want to donate, you can visit their Facebook page for now. And I'm told there will be a direct link to donate later on. So just stay tuned to their Facebook page for more announcements. But for now, that's the story from the Renaissance Folk Guild in Conover. I'm Fentress Fountain, WHKY News.